Hello and welcome back to Crafting with Tanya Friends. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to line an alligator clip. Um, just for your information, I no longer line my clips like this. I actually use clip covers that I create on my embroidery machine. And um, this is just more easier for me, faster. And I think it looks a lot professional. So let's get started. I have my 3 8 inch ribbon cut here at seven inches. And I have my lighter and my alligator clip. You can also, I have my glue gun. You can use hot glue or you can use double-sided tape. I'm out of the double-sided tape that I usually use on my ribbon. But you just place your double-sided tape here, pull back, and you're going to line the clip the same way we're going to do it with the hot glue today. So you want to take your lighter and you want to seal your ends so they don't fray. Now you want to get your hot glue and your clip. So the first thing I'm going to do is just line just a little bit of glue here. I'll take it, put it inside of my alligator clip like this. So yours should look like this. When opened, your ribbon should be on one side of the inside of your alligator clip. Now you can take the glue and you can place it on the back side of the alligator clip. Take the ribbon, move it around. Now you want to put the glue onto the ribbon for this step. I'm actually running out of glue. <laughs> you want to push it inside to the, the, the clip holders like this. And you want to bring it around to the top of your clip. And you want to finish off the rest by just putting glue on the ribbon bringing it around to the inside of your alligator clip. Now you have a fully lined alligator clip that is ready to be placed onto any of your hair accessories. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. I said don't stop, don't stop, don't stop talking to me, stop.